So the airship is a beast in Battlefield 1 as is, right? But if you know what you're doing and your squad knows what you're doing, everybody knows what they're doing, you can be an absolute monster with it, right? And I'm gonna show you how to beast with that, how to do that, my dude. So first off, let's go ahead and understand that you get five gunners on the airship and you get the driver after. So the airship will be given to the losing team on certain maps only. That's Ballroom Blitz, that's Monte Grappa, and that's St. Quentin Star. So like I mentioned earlier, it will be spawned to the person that is losing the losing enemy and it'll be spawned to you when you are close to over the for the round. When the round is close to over, it spawns by both how much time is left in the round and it spawns by how much the point difference between the enemy and your team is. So let's talk about the roles here, the gunner roll. You have five gunners on the airship. Your job as a gunner is to either destroy planes or fight ground targets, right? So seats two, three, and five are designed for ground targets. Those guns, those gunner rolls are for ground. You want to make sure you're hitting the ground targets. That's infantry and that's artillery that's on the ground. Where seats four and six, they're good for dropping planes. So just be careful about the snipers that can snipe you, right? When you're using the, the gunners on the, on the ship, you can be sniped down. So make sure that you keep that in mind. And you also want to be careful about ground artillery that can also shoot you. And then of course also planes that could try to shoot you but it's a little bit harder on the planes. So that's just my experience but it, it is possible. So now that we got the five gunners out of the way, you're going to want to learn what the driver does. What his role is on you know on this blimp, on this, on this airship. So the driver role is in charge of moving the ship around as well as dropping bombs below. A lot of people actually do not know that you can drop bombs as a driver you can right so the airship is extremely big though and it's big and it's hard to maneuver around but you'll need to co coordinate yourself well with the objectives so that you can actually cap objectives as well as uh, get make it easy for the gunners to attack people below you want to make sure you're, you're thinking about the gunners and you're thinking about the objectives your job is extremely important and it is going to take some practice to drive that thing around but you can and my dude, the best way to beast with this airship is to just know what the driver role is and what the gunner role is, man. Don't try doing what you're not meant to be doing, right? So if you're a gunner and you're meant to be shooting down planes, what are you doing shooting at the infantry? Dude, it's going to be too hard for you. Why don't you do what you're supposed to be doing and let the people that are supposed to be attacking the infantry and the artillery on the ground, let them do their job, right? That is how you're going to get the most out of this ship. Now, the thing, if you want to ask me, the thing is that I do not like using this ship. I don't think it's efficient enough. The only thing that I really do like about this ship is that you can get on it and you can easily transport over to enemy territory over their objectives and over enemy lines and actually parachute down into their objectives so that you can kill them from behind or get a head start on the objectives. That is the best thing that you can do with the ship. That is what I like doing with the ship. So now that we got all that out of the way, let's talk about the best ways to destroy this airship because a lot of times you're going to be winning and the team is going to be losing and the enemy team is going to be losing and they're going to get the airship and that's going to be an upper advantage for them. But let's destroy it, right? You want to destroy that thing fast. So the best way to destroy the airship in my opinion and from what I've seen is the AA artillery, the anti-aerial like artillery, man. The stuff that's on the ground, make sure you're using that thing to massively damage that airship. It really, really works there isn't always one available though there isn't one always at hand so the second best way is a tank in my opinion so just get on the side of a hill or something so that you can point up and make sure that you're attacking that 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 blimp like crazy the tanks will do substantial damage but uh, they're not as good as the AA guns man if you can get your hands on an anti-aerial artillery piece dude go for it man that is your that is the way to go if you want to destroy these blimps so anyway I hope you guys enjoyed don't forget to drop a like and subscribe for more daily battlefield 1 tips like this and I'll catch you guys in the next one